Hi, quick update uh, today. Actually, an interesting thing happened just now. Um, I was looking through my LinkedIn messages and um, this guy sent me a message who I've been talking with the last couple of weeks and then he's been ghosting me, I think for the last two weeks. So a potential client, right? Someone who um, I already put together a proposal for him, already sent actually a contract over and then he just started ghosting me. And um, yeah, I didn't know what the fuck was going on. And I just saw an Instagram, a LinkedIn message from him saying like, hey, been traveling, I'm back now, just resent the contract and I'll sign, which, does that mean we just signed the client? Uh, I think so. I mean, okay, so until he signed the contract and I have the money in my bank account, I am not counting anything anymore, more, okay? I am now overly pessimistic when it comes to these things because otherwise you start calculating with money you don't have, all right? And there can always be things happening. But, I mean, that would be kind of insane. Like literally yesterday, was it yesterday? No, two days ago. It was the, you know, um, I think they're kind of getting a bit um, close. Because yeah, I mean, yeah, maybe I shouldn't say it because maybe it's not gonna turn into anything and then I'm just gonna become be even sadder, sadder, but a s sadder, sadder. But I wanted to give that update. So hopefully that goes through. Um, also, we are gonna book a new place tomorrow because our current place, which is that building over there, right next to our coffee shop, uh, runs out on the 20th. Um, new people are moving in and we are leaving on May 2nd. Rick is leaving on May 7th. And so we need a place until then. And um, yeah, we're gonna go with something, you know, more simple and not a fucking big ass villa. Maybe homestay or something hostel, but whatever. Maybe we're gonna be in Changu actually. Um, so yeah, that's, that is kind of cool. And besides that, just hang out with Thomas today. Um, we haven't met in a while. He has been on his island that he's building. Maybe you guys remember that he's building a um, sustainable resort on a private island um, somewhere up in Indonesia. And he was there the last two weeks to actually build a fucking thing on the island where nothing is there right now. So that's fascinating. Um, yeah, that's the update. Nothing spectacular happening. I feel like I had a fucking topic to talk about earlier today when I was riding my scooter, you know, just riding down the road. Um, but I forgot it. If I remembered, I'm gonna talk about it, okay? I also brought the kitty to the vet. She needed to get some vaccinations. So that was fun. She didn't enjoy it for some reason, you know, getting some, some, you know, vaccines is always fun. Like I didn't get it. I'm like, yo, you know, enjoy, enjoy the ride. Um, and we're getting and finding a new home for her because we're leaving and we can't just put her out. So we're finding a new home for our kitty kitty. We probably already found one, a friend of Anastasia who she met here. She's super cool and super nice. So I should think Miracle will be happy at that home. But because we don't know if we're coming back and if, if we're coming back, when we're coming back, um, we, can't, we can't just find a temporary home for her and just say like, hey, please take care of this kitty for two weeks or a month or whatever. And so we needed to find a place for her where she can stay, where she can, where she can stay, stay. I'm gonna miss that kiddo, that weirdo, Waldo. Um, yeah, also obviously I, I realize that these vlogs are very rambly and it's just, it's basically me just documenting it. But I think it's also kind of cool because, I mean, we are at an interesting point, right? Where I'm, <laughs> I'm kind of broke right now and things are kind of not working out right now. And I'm definitely like trying to figure it out um, and um, yeah I hopefully can look back at this in like two weeks and be like <laughs> you know now I'm a billionaire and now you know everything works out and remember how two weeks ago I was kind of broke um, so yeah that's fun anyway that's the update for today
um, was a good day. It's not over, obviously. The hustle never stops. Is there a bat again? Fuck! There's a bat again in here. No, it's not a bat. Oh, it's a butterfly. Well, I was fucking pussy. All right. See you tomorrow and peace. Um, okay, so this is like 30 minutes after my last clip and uh, I wanted to show this. If you don't know what this means, I'm not sure either, but this means that the guy actually signed the contract right now. Again, I'm, I only believe it once I see the money on the bank account, but like signing a good, good contract, like I, I would say like 99.99% of the time means, you know, they're in. So yeah, I guess we just signed a client. What the hell? That, that happened so fast. He within, sent... Within 40, 30 minutes. Yeah, like, he, he sent me a LinkedIn message saying like, Hey, I've been traveling and now I'm <laughs> back. literally like, just please, half of your face. Please, please resend the contract and I'll sign. And then I resend the contract and like 30 minutes later, he signed the contract. So we're rich now. That's another 1.5 billion uh, dollar contract. So remember two days ago how we said, you know, when the moment hits where you like, you don't have any money, then Morgan Freeman comes and gives you a billion dollars. It's not quite Morgan Freeman, but it's 1.5 billion dollars. So <laughs> we're rich now. Yeah, I don't, I don't, I, uh, it's kind of weird because it's happened so fast. I'm not sure if this is real, but uh, I'm pretty sure this is real. So that's kind of cool. So I'm gonna, I guess, update you guys tomorrow again on that. But yeah, that happens fa happened faster than I expected, you know? <laughs> I mean, you didn't even expect it. No, that one, that one was the person I least expected to like come on. Like I have a couple of people that I actually followed up with today and where I actually gave them a discount and like all of these things. I'm like, come on, I'm gonna make them an offer they can't refuse. I'm gonna go down with the price. I'm gonna offer them extra things. And like this guy just comes in, from nowhere and just like hey I'm back I'm back please resend I'm gonna sign and then I send it and then 30 minutes later he signed so yeah that's kind of cool okay bye hard to wake up when there's no alarm to wake you up see